up to lesson three. Four strings I said. I'll quickly tell you their names from the big fat one on the side is called G. Next one is D. Next one is A. And the small one is E. Sometimes I call it G Daddy Bear. D Mommy Bear. A Goldilocks. Oopsie. Stop the DVD, rewind, and learn G, D, A, and E. Now that you have done that, you stand in rest position as you saw in lesson one. You do your five steps, which you know exactly what to do now. One, two, three, four. Put the hand on the wooden part, your left hand. You take your right hand, thumb. Put it under the fingerboard, the black part, so that it stays there. With Peter pointer or index finger, we're going to do what we call pizzicato. That means plucking. Pizzicato. G four times. One, two, three, four. Then the mommy bear D. One, two, three, four. Goldilocks A. One, two, three, four. And baby bear E. One, two, three, four. And rest the Remember, for these exercises, you are standing. It's just Miss Lisby is a little old and can't stand so long. That's why I'm sitting, but you have to be standing when you do this. Now stop the DVD, rewind, and do the pizzicato until it's 100% smooth. Now that you've done that, you will see the papers I gave you with the DVD where it says lesson three over there there's number one to eight number one to eight and on there you might not see it here on the DVD but you'll see it on your paper it's written there G G G G D D D D G G G G D D D D That means you've got to put this in front of you like this on your stand that you bought. You are in playing position and you go G G G then it says D D D D then it says G again G G then it says D again, D, 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 and all the other numbers have different patterns. Stop the DVD now and do all those patterns a few times, at least five times each. On the page, just above where it says lesson four, you will see the sign of what a G, this G on the violin. This is what it looks like on paper. This is what D looks like on paper. This is what A looks like on paper. And that is what E looks like on paper. Thank you. This is the end of lesson three.